Right, oh, welcome back everybody to another Dominaria Draft video. And today, today we open up a real bad rare. Yeah, I don't like this. We're not gonna do that. Uh, and these two comments aren't too exciting. I like Halar, but just a 3-3 three, three, for 3 trample in 2 colors. Do I just, do I just pick the fiery intervention for the memes? That actually seems like a decent plan here. I mean, this might wheel. <laughs> Let's do it. It's for the meme, boys. Ooh. Oh. Well. It is a 3-3 flash. Um, this does work with wizards. And if you have a lot of mana, you can actually copy stuff. Maybe that's good. Can we try and be the wizard deck? We could try and be the wizard deck. Just a seismic shift in red wasn't really exciting. I've always wanted to try the wizard deck, so let's let's try that out. Oh, Gilded Lotus, Danitha, uh, Guardians, Gelden Raider, Warcolor. Well, this is a wizard. I really like Danitha, but I don't wanna... do I want to try this? I'm just going to pick the Gelden Raider because it seems like the safest, safest pick here. <sighs> there are awesome cards here. Danitha, Adamant Will, Broken Bones, Reproach. Even even guardians. But this seems the safest pick. Ooh, well there's a deep freeze. I think that's the best card here for us. I really like Bassett Light, but yeah. Elfim Druid is okay if we get that Halar back. I think it's just Deep Freeze. That's not a removal spell, right? Wizard's Retort is okay, I guess. There's also Journey Mage, and that is a wizard. That works with, uh, with Narumeha. I'm not the biggest fan of counter spells in Illimited, but this is actually a fun one. It's, it's almost a counter spell. Like the actual genuine article counter spell. Um. Let me just take Renamok and see if we can copy it with Narumeha. Yeah, I like having combat tricks like this. I'm like, I shouldn't prioritize these two drops too highly. So, yay. Could also take another muddle, but this this lets you push through. Right, so I, I like that offer befuddle that, you know. <sighs> Just just minus four, minus zero. This is plus three, plus three in tramps. It's a boy. Wait, what was I saying? It's a boy. It's a girl. No, it's a girl. Um, nothing too exciting here. I, th I guess it's just the flyer. The can we trick? Well, there's another journey mage, as well as a frenzied rage, another seismic shift. Um, I don't hate seismic shift, but it's more of a cyborg card than anything. And 
wizards. And I'm actually going to pick the Arcane Flight here, because we already have two Journey Mages, we can pick up more later. Um, yeah, this, this is just a good aura to have. And I'll actually... Pick the Memorial over the Seismic Shift. Because this can go main deck, right? Um. I don't think we're gonna play either of these. I think Guardian Guardians of Quillos. It, it's a four-four. It's fine. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> Invoke it is. Uh, it's rescue it is. Maybe we can do some self-bound shenanigans. Well, there we go. Relic Runner. <laughs> like, first first big fire intervention. Last pick here, Relic Runner. And that's a Joseph S. There's also another journey. And a, and a Wizard, Wizard Lightning. But Man, Joseph S. And Joseph S. How many times can I say it? Man, jo I'm just gonna pick the Joseph S. It, it is a really, really good card. Um, I don't. Shh, phone. Shh. I don't know if you're playing it, but. I like it. I'm gonna pick a Journey Mage here because it's Wizard. Oh, if this was a Silver Falls. Um, wizard. What can we get back at this point? Uh, run amok and fire intervention. I don't know if it's good enough for that. Maybe it is actually. It's it's again. It's just a wizard. <gasps> Faluk and a frenzied rage. Oh. We just have an arcane fight for this Faluk, but man, if you can, if you manage to enchant him. We can pick up more enchantments, right? More and more equipments, more stuff. Uh, there's compass. There's also Rona. I'm not, not, not a fan of Fervent Strike. Maybe we just pick this Rona, this Shield of Realm, because it works with Falduk. Uh, if we manage to make Black a real splash, then Rona is just real good, right? You're not a wizard, are you? No, you're an artificer. Dang it! I picked, I picked Rona. I really like black. <laughs> Once you go black, you never go back, right? Ooh, oh, that's a good wizard. Yeah, I'll, I'll pick a Murfolk trickster. That works for me. Can we get an at least? That would be gas. I'll also settle for like a Helm of the Host on one of these jobbies, or this jobby. Or, or, you know, this jobby. You know, this guy. That seems really good. Make two, three power dudes every turn. Oh boy. Um, just a random 4 4 or a Shiven Fire. It, it's gotta be Shiven Fire, right? That seems more versatile than a 4 4 that shrinks if it gets double blocked. Plus, this is easily copyable with Narumeha. And we can get it back with Gitu Chronicler. And that seems fine. Oh, that seems a okay. What's his name, by the way? Naru Meha. It's, 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 it's. I don't know. It 
feels kind of off. Maybe that maybe that's just me. That feels fine so far. Let's see, where's the hold up? I'm at 22, this guy here is at 19. Nice turn, 28. Uh, I actually don't hate Firefly setup here. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 wizards so far, so maybe we can burn some stuff. Yeah, I'll take that over a third journey mage over level runner. Yeah, that's fine, actually. I mean, the first few times I saw this guy, I was like, it's a five mana three three. That's kind of situational, but you know, even if you manage to burn like a two, oh, perfect journey mage. I really want to helm with the host right about now, or the guy that doubles the ETB triggers of uh, wizards. And anyway, anyway, as I was saying, if it's a five mana three three that you know burns uh, two two toughness dude, it's still pretty okay. Um, do we want the fire elemental or the rampaging cyclops? We already have a few five drops, but this just feels better than a than a cyclops, right? Plus we have so many 3-drops, we can play a 3-drop on turn 3, a 3-drop on turn 4, and then have a 5-drop. Well, 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 I guess I should have taken the, uh, the, uh, the 4-drop. I'm gonna take a Seismic Shift, mainly because, oh, that, that's perfect, that's perfect. That works with Valuk. Main, mainly because, well, oh, oh. Land destruction can actually be. Oh, look at that. Can actually be uh, relevant. So, Artificer. Oh, there's, like, there's a Shivan Fire. Um, I like Shivan Fire here. This, this, I feel this is a trap. So, I'll happily take a Shivan Fire here. I was about to say you can actually pretty much run this guy, okay, because it's. A 4-4 defender? That, that's okay. Oh, journey mage. Adapt. This is basically a 4 drop ride. I'm gonna actually take the journey mage here because I have the feeling that this adapt is gonna wheel. Red has been open so far quite a bit. I like having this over the frenzied rage um, because we already have a frenzied rage. We already have an arcane flight. This might also wheel. So, there we go. Oh. We're not gonna try. <laughs> We're not gonna try it. I will take another fiery intervention, though. I think that's a bit better than a deep freeze. This is just more first, though. Even if it, even if it's more uh, expensive. Um, some good cards that might come back. Frenzy Rage, Galen Raider. Those are all okay. And I mean, really, just ideally, one of these uh, frenzied rages come back just just for Valduk. Man, I really want to see the guy that doubles ETP. I, I don't think we're gonna see it. Nobody's gonna pause a helm of the host, which is really sad. This deck has some insane ETP triggers or synergies. Also another reason to pick fire intervention over the deep freeze uh, is well journey mage bounce of stuff. <laughs> we can get a third memorial to war. We're not gonna do that. Is it just Gizu Level Runner because it's another wizard? You know what? 
screw it. I'm just gonna take this. I don't think it's 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 any good, but and yes, I've been wrecked by this card, but I don't care. I still don't think it's very good. Just just one mana dorks aren't all that hot. Because how many instants and sorcery do we have? Like one, two, three, um, four, five. I mean, I think this is enough for a six mana chronicler. I don't think it's enough for a turn one key to lever runner. Um, I actually like this Arcanist because it's another wizard and it makes these interventions cheaper. We can we can run that. I actually don't hit. I actually like Arcane Flight over Frenzied Rage here, just because, in general, giving flying is better than giving manas. There's also this Talarian Scholar, but we've already 15 creatures, so I think it's fine to take a, an Arcane Flight here. Yeah. Where are we on that fire fisted up wheeling? Uh, that's another raider. Let me play that over. Ooh, another journey mage? Do we want another journey mage and stuff? I think Ashley is radiating lightning here. Just because of the token decks. We already have three journey mages. I don't think we need a fourth one. Hmm. Adept didn't come back. None of these cards are really exciting. Ah. Well, there's another French Rage. We have, we have three things here for this Volder. We have but one Volder, so I don't think we need the French Rage. Um, we are kind of probably a bit slow, so I think having the Radiant Lightning and just another random two drop for the aggressive. No, we also have the. Uh, uh, crap, but we also have this Lever Runner against the aggressive decks, and I made a horrible mistake, but there's a Champion of the Flame. Maybe we can try that. Look, we got all the tech for three color decks. Uh, just having one random champion doesn't do anything. I kind of like this. Uh, these are basically four drops. These are also basically four drops if we have a, an Arcanist out. So I think we can get away with. 16 lands and no splash because I kind of forgot that we had these guys. So I'm just gonna add 16 lands here and cancel that because we're gonna add two memorials. Is that yeah, that's fine. And then we're gonna add oh. Let's sort these by uh, by color. Right, so we do have way more reds than blue. We also have double blue for the trickster, but uh, let's just go eight eight. Do I want two tap lands here? My stomach is growling. I should get some food. Yeah, this seems fine. Let's try it out. Wizard's Ahoy! And we can make this larger. 
Ooh, that was fast. Hey, that's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. And we won the die roll. Oh, gee, what could go wrong? We'll play first. We will wish our opponent some good luck. And fun. And I think we can keep this hands. We got Relicrunner into hopefully double Journey Mage or... No, Journey Mage and uh, Narumeha. So we're going to keep this hand. Oh, our opponent just responded with good luck. They don't want to stay off on. I see, I see. So this time I'm going to try not to F6 through my turns or anything. That seems like a uh, really smart plan. Well, there's a lance. Look at that. Everything is coming up Millhouse. Oh boy. Oh boy. We're playing against the superior wizard deck, aren't we? Yep. Yes, we are. That's not bad. Ha ha ha! Pizza girl! This is where they go, at least, and go nuts, and we're like, hmm. We want. Oh! The fork. Oh! We got deck for the, the three color deck. Oh my. Oh my. That's that's a good that's a good card. Look at that. We got tucked for that as well. Okay, give me a land so I can make this guy a four three. That's a land. So basically we attack, they just double block and we make this guy larger. Unless they have shift and fire, in that case it's just really bad. They're like, what? what's happening? What? Oh. Yeah, this is exactly what I was afraid of. Why can't we, why can't we copy instance and sorceries our opponent controls? That's just so... I just want to live in that world. Okay, sure. But you're going to have to check a problem for that. So that's... Aren't they blocking? Why, huh? Why didn't they block? Because next turn they go wild onslaught, make their team, you know, huge, and then you're cooked. Oh, yeah, that that's a fair point. Alright, buddy. Jahoba. What's your plan? I really hope you guys don't hear my stomach crowding because. Oh. Well, that's cool too. You gonna bounce my Naru? Naru. I can't pronounce this name, I don't know why. Yep, consider her bounced. Wait, why didn't you check with this guy? So you, you can block? Okay, well, I'll take two. I will take two. Hmm. 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 If this was a land, I would probably burn the, the Journey Mage in attack for three. But I guess we just just play Naru again. 
I'm not gonna bother flashing her in. They know we have her. Now we can f6. Save some time. But but what if they have fire intervention? Yeah, I didn't think of that. So call me stupid. Go ahead and comment in the comments that I make mistakes. Yeah, well, that's bound to happen. Well, if you... If you have a combat trick, I'm gonna see it. They did not have a combat trick. They have a kicked untamed Gavu. We have a journey mage of our own. I don't want to attack into this this board because, well, trading a journey mage for a 1 3 and a 1 1 is maybe just fine if we can journey mage and then intervention this dude. Maybe that's just fine. So do you take four or do you triple block? Or do you just jump? They did not block. Interesting. Oh no, it's back, the untamed Kavu. No. Can we get a land so we can intervention that thing? Burn it to the, back to the... I was gonna say burn it back to the Stone Ages, but I don't think that's how the saying works, right? Lance! Oh, it's a lance. That's pretty good. Wait, wait, wait. Soundboard! Oh, Very good! There we go. Okay, let's do the thing. No, don't have a 5-5. Five, five. Alright, we're just gonna attack with the 4-3s here. And I'm gonna leave her back because losing the plus 1 plus 1 seems... ...not okay. Why aren't they blocking? I don't know why they're not blocking. And they just coop. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I'm I'm a bit surprised by all that, but it it's fine. Um, you know what? You know what? We're gonna bring in a seismic shift, and we're gonna take out. They didn't seem to have real big dudes outside of the the uh, five five. Maybe over a deep freeze because well making stuff unable to block seems better than making something a, a over. Plus we have the the double intervention, we have double journey mage, run a mock to get past like the, the the big dudes. Double double arcane flights. And denying them mana seems okay. Or denying them a color rather. All right. Um, this is a bit iffy because we have two five drops, but we have a burn spell right here, which is, I guess, almost a five drop. Uh, I think we still keep it. We got four lands. We can play everything in our deck. Almost everything in our deck. Why does he say we can play everything when we have four lands and he has five drops in his hands? Yeah, I don't know. We're gonna keep this. We're gonna be fine. Famous last words, everybody. Oh, I'm so jealous. Uh, yeah, we can actually get that out of the way. Can we blow up a Silver Falls? Maybe. This is also. Yeah, this is a six drop. 
That's a good one. Maybe just kill that thing. You know, deny you some ramp. Deny you the, thir the turn 3. 5-5. Five, five. No. I don't want you to ramp. <sighs> that is okay. Okay, Lance, you can stop now. Um, I don't need you anymore. Yeah, let's let's just play this dude for blocks and whatnot. Wait, are they stuck on three lands? Okay. Oof. That's a lot of tokens. And no attacks. Interesting Warlord Fury there. So they are digging for lands here. Oh. Yeah, you're not that hot here. I was like, oh, it's a good dude. So we're basically just bouncing a token here. And have a dude on the board. Oop, get rid of you. Um, pass it up here. Pass, pass it up. I mean, I could wait, but you know, then they're just building up forces, and I just have a one-three here. And of course, you don't want to bounce the, the, the two-two that makes a token. So, oh, just getting rid of a one-one. It's it's fine. It's like. Getting rid of half a card. But they, they did find another land. Um, nothing. Interesting. Interesting. Do I just fire fist adapt and attack trade the journey mage for two superlings? I think that's fine. I mean, that advances our board. Plus, we still have four remo four. Why am I saying these numbers? Two removal spells. Right here. They're like, wait, what, what is this? What is this? Are we going to react to this? Are we going to bounce something? Oh, this, that is fine. Sure. You're going to give it plus one plus one? No, it just died. Well... I will attack with the uh, with the one three. Okay. Good talk. Good talk. Maybe they didn't realize that th this thing uh, does count itself for the number of wizards. That's. Fine, I think you yeah. sure bounce bounce my fire for setup. That's a good card. That is a good good card. Sure. Baby got tapped. Are we taking two here? We're taking two here. And just more lands. So. At least we can blow up a force in a bit. Um, I see no point in not attacking here, so... I mean, this this guy's gonna get tapped anyway. So let's just get in there for one. We can keep up shift and fire here. Tap, tap down this chronicler! You know you wanna tap that. Look at that. Halty. Come on. There. Wait, what? Okay. 
that's fine too. <gasps> oh look, it's another lens. Yeah, or do we blow up the Sulphur Falls to the Night in Red? I don't know. I feel like... I don't know. They are strange for our color, that's the feeling I have. I don't know which one. Yeah, sure. I'll take two. That is fine. Those little, little colorful cuties. And a journey mage. Well, that is shift and fireable. And we're just gonna kick this just in case they have like the plus two, plus two in hand. Plus, if they have single page, we can still pay one. What's up with all these lands? This is not okay. Well, now we can just leave this guy back because they're gonna bounce this dude. And then they certainly can't really attack anymore. What do we blow up here? A forest or the silver falls? I really don't know. I blew up the forest. And then we're gonna pass. Yep, you can bounce this guy. That is totally okay. Ah, uh, nothing. Okay, feeling good. Feeling good. <gasps> and we got more dudes. And let's get in there with the Chronicler. You know, I'm not gonna play the land just in case we draw like a Kelden Raider or something. Then we can just pitch the land, and we can we can cost everything in our deck. So I think we made the right choice blowing up that forest. <gasps> it's you. No, and if, if, if my next draw can be like an Arcane Flight or Frenzied Rage. One, two, three, you. One, two, three, you. Alright, we got a game here. Um. Oh. Oh, are you gonna end step bounce? No. No, you still, you just have five cards now. Oh, there's your little forest. Oh look, it's another separate. I will actually take a run mark. Yeah, what's the worst they can do in response to a run amok bounce something? Burn it. Yeah, probably something like that. I'm not gonna try it anyway. Wait, you're huh? Oh, there you go. Double block this guy. I'll trade here. Oh, yeah, this is okay. Whoop. Oh, that happens. Oh boy. And we still have a fire intervention here. 
Oh boy. It feels like we're ahead here. Watch, watch them play as a brawling migration. I'm like, oh. Yeah, that's six mana to go to uh, to kick. So they can make four one ones. Watch them play as proud swarm. Now just bouncing something. Okay, uh, I think I think we did it, boys. I think we did, it, boys and girls. Yeah, you can't you can't bounce this dude. This doesn't really do anything. You have to bounce the Valdirk. And any shift and fire or rescue is not gonna save your ass here. Oh, we can we can also just do that. Booyah, got him. Right, oh everyone, welcome back to match two. I'm just back after a hasty, hasty. Oh dear, hasty break. Uh, we're not gonna keep this hand because one land. So let's let's move this, <laughs> and it's a one lander. You know what? We're gonna draw more lands. I know it. That is not a land. <sighs> well, let's hope we draw a mountain next turn. Um. Oh dear. Oh, oh boy. Lands? That is not a lands. Awkward. <laughs> Come on, just give me two lands off the top. It's a land. It's the wrong land. It's still a land. We're gonna take it. Now, now we're gonna draw a mountain and we're gonna feel good because suddenly we have a game. Ooh. What are you gonna get? Another swamp, a third color, a footished. Okay, cool, cool. Okay, watch this mountain. It is not a mountain. Well, this is getting awkward. So basically, we're just gonna continue and see if we can see something of our opponent's deck. Oh, well, there's that forest. Oh, look, we're playing against all the separate decks. Well, I guess we're taking one. Lands. Oh, it's a lands. So I guess we just play Journey Mage here, right? Make makes this guy one cheaper. Can block the one one. Can block the the Skittering Surveyor. And they have five lands. <laughs> Then six cards in hands. Yeah, well, we're gonna. Yeah, actually. Maybe we trade. No, we're not trading here. We're, we're taking two. We can go to 17. And they had nothing. Well, it, it's another wizard. We can actually play this and keep up Shiv and Fire, and that seems fine. Yeah, no point in attacking here. Man, just give me two lands. Uh, we've got a game. And they have six lands and they haven't played anything yet. Oh boy. That is, that is actually scary. Oh boy. Oh dear. Oh dear. Don't go nuts on tokens, please. Just, just, just don't. Wait, what? Oh. Yeah, that, that is good. I'll admit that is that is slightly scary. Um, <laughs> awkward. I'm just gonna kill this dude right now. Well, at least we can. <sighs> Man.
Man, choices. I don't really feel the need to cast Journey Mage here because it feels better to, to cast that after they have the plus one plus one counters. So maybe it's just Keldon Raider here, discard Chronicler, dig for lands. And that is a land. Well, no attacks for obvious reasons. Oh, I can double block here if they attack with a 5-5. Five five. It's probably going to be a blowout because they have the... Uh, no. Wait. Do they just have lands? Oh, that's not shabby. I actually like Firefist Adapt. Kill this dude. Um, and I'll, I'll probably just take 6 here and then bounce it with a Journey Mage. But this adds to the board. And we can ar maybe just start Arcane Flighting something next turn. Yeah, we definitely can because this costs 4. Kill you. Yeah, then we can Arcane Flight this dude, get in for 5. Man, indestructible trample vigilance and other lands. Hmm. Oh, so they were like, nah, let's not do that. I don't know why. You know what, we're not going to block. It feels like they have a combat trick. Um, actually, we can just block with the, the Arcanist, right? If they want to waste a combat trick on that, that is actually just fine. Gonna give this guy plus two plus two? Or are you gonna be happy that it just bounces off? No, they're gonna... That is sad. That is really sad. Dang it. Why you gotta be so rude? And nothing else. Interesting. Well... Bounce you. Make you float. Get in for four. Achievement unlocked. Dead damage. Achievement unlocked. Enchanted a creature. Oh! Oh, look at that. Oh, this is where they go like, Haha, I've got a Dairy Gods all along. And I'm gonna be like, that's so sad. No, just a fire intervention. Okay, cool, cool. That, that also works. See, th this this happens to me every time. Like I go, like, hey, hey, I've got a cool aura. I'm gonna, I'm gonna enchant something, and then they're like, yeah, we've removal. Um, I'm just gonna kill this thing right here. Get some damage in. Draw something awesome. I oh, oh, that's pretty okay. That's actually really good. If they go like 6 drop again, we can just bounce it. Get some damage in. Whoop! 7 yeah. And more lands. Our opponent has a lot of lands. There you go, buddy. Get your feral abomination there. And nothing. I wonder, do they just have lands? Hmm. 
about it. Oh my. Oh my. Are we getting back from, you know, the awkward one land hand? After a mulligan. They're at two. Oh man. We did- What? We just came back from that- Oh man. That is just gravy. That is real gravy. Okay, so is there anything we want to bring in here? <sighs> they have tokens. Do we just... We only saw one card that made tokens, right? So I don't know if Radiant Lighting is any good here. Again, I think we're just fine. We have one memorial to war. Well, if they seem really heavy on another color, we can bring in Seismic Shift if we lose the next one, but I think we're fine as it is. Um, we can keep this hand. Keep these. We have Shift and Fire for one. We got a Wizard on turn three, a Wizard on turn four. And uh, a mark just in case. That seems a okay. All right, show us the goods. No goods. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna pause here. Keep up Shiv and Fire. They're like, they're holding a Shiv and Fire rod. And I'm like, yep, I am. And still nothing. Are they keeping up Fish's offering? Or oh. Lance? I know. Oh, I just played this guy out there because it's a three power dude. They have nothing. If they play something with that we can ambush with Nahumeha, I'm fine. Otherwise, we can just keep Nahumeha and maybe just twink. Oh, that is a good, good card. Right, so... <sighs> hmm, the five toughness is not ideal. I'm just gonna attack here. We're not... Oh, oh dear, let's not F6. Let's attack here, and if they block, we have run amok. And they're not gonna block, right? No. Alright, let's just pause here and hope they don't have any scary shenanigans. Oh my lord! I'm like, can I just say, wow. That is scary. Well, we're taking four here. Man, do I feel bad about my attack now. Okay, fire intervention one time. That is not a fire intervention. Man, that is so good. Well, 
Als die equipment the token gets haste, oké, okay, cool. Well, if they equip and they're like, yeah, we can attack double, then they just die to attack and run amok, right? Yep, that is scary. But we have some outs here. I mean, any bounce spell. Fire intervention. Or they're play at safe and they just don't attack at all, which is a thing. Which is a thing. Actually, drawing something like uh, Journey Mage, the Academy Journey Mage. Oh, they chose to attack. I think drawing Academy Journey Mage wins the game because we can just bounce this dude. And we still have random mock mana, so we can attack for 10. That is not an Academy Journey Mage. I could just attack here and bump for th plus 3 plus 3. And then they're going to show off these are the uh, fungal infection and then we're going to be sad. I think that's what we have to do here. Because if, if they don't have it, it still puts us ahead and gives us a couple of good draws. Man. All I'm asking for is you not blocking and not having a fungal infection. <gasps> they are, are they blocking? They are blocking. And now we have to run amok you. And that happens. So you go to 4 here? No, to 5. Man. This game is tense. This game is really tense. We still have a couple of awesome draws here, so I'm just gonna assume that it'll all work out in the end, but this is just nuts. Yep, there you go, buddy. There you go. And I hope you guys don't hear the dog barking below, because people are talking, you know, in front of the house, they're standing there, they're just not doing anything. Oh, no attacks. Well, what we can do is bounce a token, and if they block somewhere, we can just shift and fire the, the, the fess. Get rid of it like that. Man, just one turn ago. Bounce you. I'm gonna attack with everybody here. I mean, you're gonna block here, right? Okay, just just don't have a bump spell or something. <sighs> don't have the bump spell. They didn't have the bump spell. 
we power through triple Jojo Fest here, I think. Oh, we power through. <laughs> we power through. Oh, oh my god. And there at one. <laughs> Just, just, oh my god, we have so many love draws here. Another journey mage, either of these. Any burn spell to get rid of a blocker. Did we, go, did we get him? Is the question here. Man, th 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 this is so awesome. Oh. Wait, why didn't you... Huh? Well, I, I spoke too soon, but why didn't you save your, your Joseph S? That would have been better, right? Yeah, I didn't know what. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. We still, we still might just be able to get through. Just a journey mage. Um, any, anyone. We still have like three in the deck, right? That also works perfectly. I forgot about the French rage. We just, we just won. I believe we just won. Yeah. Oh, we got him. Oh, getting back. But man, those were two epic matches. Wow. Wow. This deck is great. Oof. Very good. Awesome. I. Man. Joseph S into Helm of the Host, that is the scariest thing I've seen so far. Getting a 4 or 5 mana every turn is just so huge. Man. Just wow. Just really wow. All right, match three. You know, I'm happy with the deck. I'm, I'm happy with the results so far. We're playing against Wiki Wiki Wah. I love that name. Kind of a slow hand, but deep freeze, removal, awesome four drops. We're gonna keep this hand. And we're on the on the draw. So, I was hoping, you know, to get something cheaper, but you know, another fire intervention. Now, this is for, uh, I forgot your name, but this is for the guy that says, yeah, you should, you should pick the second uh, intervention of the two drop. Like, you're right, you're right. Wiki, wiki, no, wiki, wiki, that's, I don't know, I think something in me just feels that this is an epic name. Wiki, wiki, wah. Oh, not against the... Why do we always play against the same decks? Well, next turn we all uh, we, we could also play uh, an Academy Drake, and we're gonna bring in Seismic Shift, I guess. Ooh. Well, it's another lands. Yay! I got floats. And you're gonna play like an awesome five drop. Because that's how you do, right? And I'm gonna be like, oh, outclassed. Or just deep freeze it. Oh, that's deep freezable. And. Yeah, I actually don't hate deep freezing this thing. Or we just take four, cast Nero, Meha, and see what our options are for next turn. That doesn't that that's not better, right? 
Oh my god, he made a misplay. I don't know. I have a floater. Well, maybe he's got lands. And again, the dog is angry at, you know, the world outside because people are collecting the trash. And, you know, he just can't stand people outside. It's just... Why? Why? Why is this a thing? Oh, okay. This is actually fine. Um, do we just even fire this dude? Do we just kill this straight up here? I think we do. Now, actually, I like fire intervention because this doesn't seem like the artifact deck. And this is... Oh, you know what? I don't care. Oh, this is 4 damage. This is 5 damage. And this is a 3. Toughness, dude. I'm just gonna kill all your dudes. And they only have three cards in hand after that draw step. So. It feels like we aren't in a bad spot per se. Yeah, there we go. That that is far interventionable. Only have one card in hand. I'm dealing with everything you have, sir. Um, I'm actually gonna keep that in hand just so we can discard it to Kelden Raider. Oh boy, they have sixed. We're dealing with everything here, and this Drake is doing some work. Yeah, make this a one five. five. That is okay. That is okay. Surveyor, I don't, I don't care about you. They got a forest and whisper. Okay, whisper is scary. Okay, give me Shivan Fire. No, Arcanist. <sighs> they can suck both of these to get something back here that we can just kill again. I don't think I, I'm gonna care. If you wanna suck two dudes. Oh, that's also pretty okay. Oh, just soul salvage. Okay. I'm kind of happy I didn't kill the whisper. So just slimy and the big 5-5. Five five. That is actually a bit scary. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. I don't know if that does anything. So if you attack with the, the raider, they just block with their 1-5 and nothing happens. We could just go ahead and bounce something. I mean, probably... Let's see, 4, 1, 2... 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... So they just have grun in a hand, right? Let's just say grun in a hand. So unless you draw lands, you can't recast either of these if you play Grun. Do I just... This is more expensive, but they could just start making tokens, and that's also kind of scary. I kind of want to bounce the expensive one, though. Oh, I have no wizards. I was like, oh, this thing always costs four in my deck. Nah, bounce you. Uh, 
and duck for two. Maybe I should have waited, you know, until they cast their Grom. But we can just fire intervention that, so I don't think it really matters. Ah, oh, they just drew a land. So this is Grom, right? You have Whisper and Hands. Okie do. Oh, they kicked. Oh, crap. I forgot about the kicker. Yeah, now I feel kind of sad. Maybe we can just jump him for days, right? And we can tap him down. And you're not doing anything here. So I guess we're just attacking with the 2 2 in the air again, because we can. And I guess we play Falduk. And step this dude down. Whoop. Got him. And nothing, they just kept up mana for, for tokens. Uh, 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 uh. So you whisper and one other card in hands. I feel it's just Raider, get rid of this Arcanist. Have all the champ blockers in the world, find something else. And if you can get Arcane Flat up on this dude. Or just in anything in general, I think. They're going to 6. Yeah. This Drake has been doing some work. This Drake has dealt 14 damage so far. I'm just going to play all the chump blockers I can. Oh no. You can kill some... Oh, you're just going to make some tokens. Okay. Okay. But okay. Yes. Oh, that's pretty okay. That is pretty okay. So now they have to choose. Are we attacking with the 2020 or are we trying to get some life back? Or just with the 10 10. So. I'm just gonna jump you. I'll, I'll, I'll take two here. So Whisper and two unknown cards. That's pretty solid. If they have no way to deal with the Drake, then I'm gonna put them to two. Boy. So now they have to find an answer to this Drake, right? And their pain costs. Well, just making some links. Sure. You go ahead, buddy. You make your support links. Yep, make another dude. That's fine, I can take four. That's not scary at all. We're at 18. You just drew a lands. You have a whisper and two unknowns in your hands? And attacking with everything. You know what? I'll buy it. Um, block you. Block you. Block you. Actually. Yeah, that's fine. This is where they go like, Walt on slots! And I'm like, yeah, okay, cool. So I'm taking 12. Oh, 
Okay. Wow. That went pretty well. We're going to bring in Radiant Lightning here. And... I think we're going to take out... We're going to take out... What, do, what don't we like here? I think everything is fine. Maybe just Radic Runner because it doesn't do well against 1-1s. One Maybe another... Excuse me. Um, they played three colors, right? Or didn't they? Was that the other guy? That's fine like this. Um, I'll keep it blind. Oh, we're on the draw, so let's see what we draw for our turn before we decide to play either Memorial or Mountain. So at this point it's just Mountain because we don't have a 2 drop to play. Now we get to keep up Shift and Fire. You know, for stuff like that. That is fine. Get get a swamp there. Birdo, Ricky Ricky Wa. I love that name. Okay, that's cool too, I guess. I mean we can take one here. I'm not gonna play a, a one three just to block the, the, the surveyor. Okay. That's slightly annoying. And that's pretty good. So we're just gonna flash in uh, the wizard here, a master wizards, to block the the one two one two. We can take three, I think. And if they have like a combat trick, then so be it. They didn't have a combat trick. Look, it's a whisper. Okay. Oh, we got all the wizards up here. Um, I think it's just journey mage. Keep shift and fire. I can also bounce this, but this is more expensive. Whoop. Bounce you. Goodbye. And attack for three. Man, this is such good tempo. I'll take three here. Oh, all the lands in the world. And we can just intervention that, crack back for seven. Hmm, that's also not shabby. Give one of these dude that floats. Yes, we'll take another three. Oh man, ten ten. There's Whisper again. No! And a Knight of Malice. Okay, so we're getting rid of that. Now we're getting rid of Whisper. Oh. Oh, that's actually not that bad. Hmm. I kind of like killing Whisper just attacking so they can block if they want to. I mean that gets rid of a dude and they still have this this arcane flight. We could also kick Chronicler. Now we can do that next turn I think. So cost kill you. Now we're gonna attack with both of these. 
and they chose not to block. I'm gonna put you to, to one here. And I will block anything you play, you, you attack with. Man, the wizard deck is awesome. I don't think that's gonna do it. Okay, so they were, they were like, no, nah, we can't attack here. Oh boy. <laughs> we got there! <laughs> I was like, should I just play Fall Look and Enchant him? But that doesn't really do anything. That just feels cute. Let's just go for the win here. And we won! Ah! Oh. oh man, the, the Wizard deck is so awesome. I'm so glad I, I actually got there. And I have to wait over an hour to get into this draft. It's been. Wow! Anyway, guys, um, thank you so much for watching. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. But, uh, you know, don't be deterred about, you know, stupid comments I make in re as a reply to your comments. Uh, because I do that at times. But uh, I, I, I do appreciate if you guys, you know, try to think with me. and You know. So thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, I hope to catch you next time. Cheerio.